Greetings, parents and students. This is Mrs. Hefner, and I'm going to show you how to log into our virtual classroom. First, get onto Google Chrome. Then, search for Cobb County School District. That's CobbK12.org. When that page comes up, Notice the banner across the top of the page and click on Parents. Then go to the Sign Up Sign In section and click on CTLS Learn Login. When you're on that page, you're going to see two bars pop up. In the first bar, you're going to type in your student's Cobb County email address. That's their first name, dot, last name, at students.cobk12.org. And the password is 123. Then click on Sign In. Here is our virtual classroom. The first section with the green heading is Mrs. Hefner's second grade class. This is your homeroom. You will click on this section every day at 7.50 a.m. so that you can hear our morning announcements and you can see and learn and work with your teacher. Whenever we have specials, your student will have to log out of our classroom and go back to this page where it says My Classes. And here they can go to music class when it's time for music, PE when it's time for physical education, and art when it's time for visual arts. At this time, let's explore inside of Mrs. Hefner's second grade digital class by clicking on this rectangle. Inside of our class, you're going to see the instructors and the teachers that will also be helping Mrs. Hefner this year. You'll see a clever login link and we'll talk about that shortly. You'll see any announcements here you'll see our Welcome Back to School video for students, Meet the Teacher for Parents. You can also meet other teachers and the counselors at our school by clicking on the pictures. On the right-hand side of our virtual classroom, you'll see a virtual classroom that students can click on different containers in the reading station and the math station to continue learning while class is not in session. Just hover over the different pictures and have fun learning about what's inside of the different links. I also have a virtual library with our classroom code attached. If you click on this picture, it will take you to a library full of fun and interesting books to read. Don't forget to log in that classroom code. Look at the banner on the left-hand side of the screen. We are currently in our home class. If you want to see Mrs. Hefner, and learn from her live, that's when you click on digital sessions. So let's click on that square and see what comes up. Here we have our whole group learning session and this is where you need to click at 7.50 every morning so that you can hear our morning announcements and you can learn from Mrs. Hefner. Whenever you are asked to leave a whole group and go to a small group, then you would come back to digital sessions and click on 
new digital learning session with Mrs. Hefner in our small group. Sometimes the teachers that also work along with Mrs. Hefner will ask you to go into a small group as well. And that's when you either click with Ms. Stanton or with Ms. Taylor in their small group sessions. Okay, let's see what that whole group learning session will look like. I'm gonna click it now. Here's a video you can watch of me explaining what we'll do and how to get on a live session. I'm going to tell you right now, all you have to do is click on this green bar that says join live session. After you join the live session, you're going to have two options to join with CTLS or to join using Zoom. Please pick the Zoom option if it's compatible with your computer. As soon as you click that option, you'll see Mrs. Hefner live on screen and I'll take it from there. Now let's go back to the clever or that big blue C that you saw earlier. I'm going to go back to the home button, which is on the left-hand side of the screen. And here's that C. It stands for clever. After you click on the C, you're going to see another bar that looks like this with the red, green, blue, and yellow square. Then you'll click on that. Let me show you how. I'm clicking on the C for clever. And here are those four colored boxes. After you click on those boxes, logging in with the Clever directory, you'll see a page like this. On this page are connections, direct links to Dreambox, which is a math activity that we use, Spelling City, Raz Kids, which is a reading link, Head Sprout reading link, Epic Library, where you can find many read aloud books and books that your child can read on their own with quizzes. CTLS Student, which is what we're looking at right now, and Seesaw, where your child will find daily assignments. Here are some other directions as to how to get into these different websites when they pop up. So boys and girls and parents, this is going to be a great year. I'll see you soon.